Thank you for joining me in this video. In this video, we have perfect squares and square roots. All right. Now we have one raised to the power two. That is one squared. Okay. Is simply equal to one times one, right? And one times one is just one. Okay. Then from the square root side, okay, when we have the square root of one, all right, is simply is simply equal to what one. So do you see one times one is one, the square root of one is still one, all right? Now, we have again, two raised to the power two, that is two squared, all right? Two squared is simply two times two, two times two, and two times two is just four, okay? Now, when we shift to half, the square root of um, four, the square root of four is simply two, okay? The square root of 4 is simply 2. Is simply two. All right? Again, we have 3 squared. We have 3 squared. Okay? We have 3 squared. What this means is just 3 times 3. Okay? Which is equal to what? 9. All right? Um, again, we have the square root of 9. The square root of 9 is simply 3. Okay? The square root of 9 is simply 3. And again, we have 4 raised to the power 2, that is 4 squared, okay? And 4 squared is simply 4 times 4. And 4 times 4 is um, 16, alright? So, in the um, square root, okay, we have the square root of what? 16, you know, to be equal to what? 4, alright? The square root of 15 is just equal to 4, okay? Now, we have um, 5, 5 raised to the power 2, that is 5 squared. 5 squared is simply equal to 5 times 5, alright? And 5 times 5 is um, 25, you get me? Now, when you have the square root of 25, okay, we simply have what? 5. The square root of 25 is what? 5. We go again, um, 6, 6 raised to the power 2, alright? And 6 raised to the power 2 is simply 6 times 6, Okay, which is equal to 36. Alright. Now when we go to that of the square roots, okay, the square root of 36 um, is simply equal to what? 6. Okay? The square root of 36 is simply equal to 6. Now we go to 7. 7 raised to the power 2. Alright. 7 raised to the power 2 is simply 7 times 7, which is equal to 49. Alright? 7 times 7 is simply equal to 49. Now, when we have the square root of um, 49, okay, is simply equal to 7. Alright? It's simply equal to 7. Now, we, we go again, we have that of the 8, okay? We have that of the 8, that is 8 raised to the power 2, alright? 8 raised to the power 2 is equal to 8 times 8 which is equal to 64, okay? Now, from the square root side, we have the square root of 64 to still be equal to what? 8, okay? The square root of 64 is still 8, all right? Um, and again, we have 9, okay? Again, we have 9. 9 squared, okay, is simply equal to 9 times 9. 9 times 9, which is equal to 81, all right? 9 times 9 is simply 81. Now, when we have the square root of 81, when we have the square root of 81, okay, we simply have what? 9, all right? Do you get it? So now we have 10, and 10 is just where we end, okay? So 10 squared, all right? 10 squared is simply equal to 10 times 10, all right? Which is equal to what? 100. Okay, now when we have the square root of 100, okay, we simply have what? 10. We simply have what? 10. So do you see, so this is what we actually call uh, perfect squares, all right, and uh, square roots, okay? The left hand side is the perfect square, and the right hand side, you know, that has the radical sign is the square roots. Hope you found this helpful. Please do like, comment, and share my videos. Follow my page for more videos. Thank you for watching.